Major event happening in Rocky Hill today to help out our veterans. It's called Stand Down, and it's putting a spotlight on the brave men and women who put their lives on the line for our nation. News 8's Brian Spiro shows us what it's all about. Hundreds of veterans lining up this morning in Rocky Hill, right outside the Department of Veteran Affairs. It's very important. Because some of the guys that I know, they really need it. They're here to take advantage of countless resources and services free of charge. Clinical support services, dental and medical screenings, DMV, judicial are here, veteran service organizations, housing and employment providers are here as well, including private employers. The event is called Stand Down, modeled after a concept during the Vietnam War. These services life changing for many men and women. Some of them have now fallen on hard times and need the help. The veterans need help. Uh, they, they definitely need help because I see a lot of them struggling. A lot of them struggling. Oh, I tell you, it's very important. Some of these guys, I hate to say, some of them are down and out. Just a, a hat and a pair of socks will go a long way with these guys. And you actually see them, uh, they'll, they'll break down and cry. News 8 speaking with a number of people who served our country proudly. They say our veterans are often forgotten about. You drive coming off the highway, you see a veteran out there. I'm a veteran, and I roll the window down and I give him two bucks. That, I, that shakes me up. There should be no homeless veteran around. Nobody. Yeah, it hurts. It, it, it hurts. You know, what can you say, you know? That's the world. Today, serving as a reminder that their issues are real and need to be addressed, something the VA knows all about. Well, we provide these services here one day a year in a one stop shopping. We are here 365 days a year for our veterans with our federal partners. If you are a veteran and in need of any type of services or help, you can contact the VA healthcare system here in Connecticut. We'll put those numbers on our website, WTNH.com. Reporting from Rocky Hill, Brian Spiros, News 8.